One Texoma team remains in the Texas high school basketball playoffs. It's the Christ Academy Lady Warriors, and they are preparing for a state championship game this weekend. Patrick Mitchell and company traveling to College Station looking to bring home the school's first ever basketball state title. MJ Baird has more on our team of the week. I'll tell you what, man. For the first time in school history, basketball is playing for a state championship. It don't get no better than that, baby. Let's go, Warriors! Christ Academy is on the brink of history, not only chasing the school's first basketball title, but also looking to win state for the second time this academic year. The Lady Warriors won a ring on the volleyball court in the fall. Yes, now a different sport, but as they say, success breeds success. A winner is a winner. It doesn't matter what sport you play. If you're accustomed to winning, you know what it feels like. So you go out there and you do that little bit extra. You die for that ball. You shoot that jumper, you take that charge. I feel like we have our core main group and that we just like, we have the experience, we know the pressure, we know what the standards and everything like that, but just our motto's been to prove it because nobody's thought we could get this far and so it is so exciting to just prove everybody wrong and just show what we're capable of. As a team, Christ Academy is capable of a whole lot, thanks in large part to Rulia. The floor general, as her coach calls her, she can play any position, leads the team in stats, and sets the bar high for her teammates. I have my energy and my teammates match that energy, so um, we talk about how it's a privilege to have pressure, and so I just take that on and I get excited and just pump up my teammates, and I just have to be a leader for them on and off the court. When she was off the game, everyone stepped up because it's a we attitude, not a me. Even though she may, our, she may be our best player, everyone steps up when it's their call, and that's how we play basketball. But now it's bigger than basketball. One gold medal already, this team tries to make it two helping Christ Academy leave its mark in TAPS 1A. It's the school. It's Christ Academy is playing for this. We're just the face. These girls are representing for themselves, and for the school, and for Wichita Falls. College Station to Wichita Falls, about a five-hour ride, one that would feel a whole lot shorter with a championship trophy in tow. With your Team of the Week, I'm MJ Baird, KFDX 3 Sports. One game for all the marbles. Saturday morning tip-off set for 10 o'clock at College Station High School. Christ Academy taking on Cornerstone Christian out of San Angelo. We will bring you the highlights on Saturday night.